Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. To myself, what a wonderful So today's video is going to be the last update to my summer project pan. So right now it is currently July 31st, it's about to be August 1st, and this is my last update for the project. I'm going to post the finale on the last day of August, and then on September 2nd, which is a Friday, I will post my fall project use it up. So this is really the last like month that I'm able to really try and get through these products that I'm gonna show you guys. So I'm really trying to either finish them up or hit a milestone on them, and then I'm gonna transition into fall. So if you're excited to see, I finished a lot of stuff in the last month, so I hope you're ready. I have stuff that I finished, I have stuff that I'm working on, and then a few new things that I'm gonna introduce. So let's go ahead and get on into it. So I'm gonna start with the full size body care that I did end up finishing since the last update. And the first one is the Margarita Cupcake Body Cream. So excited to have finished this one up. It was really, really yummy. It was from 2021 in the summer. I definitely did not want it to go bad. So I've been using it up. Ugh, the scent is absolutely amazing. Margarita Cupcake is just so good. I really didn't like it in any other form but the body cream, but it was so, so good. And um, I don't even know if I had any progress lines on this one. Um, I think it was about halfway last time. I just cut it open so I could get the last bit out so I can't really tell where the progress lines were, but I think this ended up taking me two months to use up. And then I did just finish off Christmas cookies in the shower gel. So happy to have this one out of my collection. Um, here's the progress lines on that. It started out right here and then we went to here and then I finished it up in the past month. There's like a little bit left, but I couldn't get it out in my shower last night. So I'm just gonna consider it empty. Um, but yeah, I've been working towards finishing this one just because I don't really want to have a lot of Christmas stuff left over. I want to be able to buy new Christmas stuff when it comes out, so I don't want to continue to keep something that I've already used. So yeah, finish this one off. Another full-size item that I finished off, I pretty much finished off like a whole set, is Confetti Cake Pop in the Body Lotion. It looks really crazy because it has like a little bit of lotion. It was sitting like this earlier, um, but I did finish it off. I got out as much as I could. I even like Took the cap off and like used my finger to dig out the last bit that I could but here's the progress lines on that so it started off in the summer right here down in a month down to here in a month down to here in a month and then finished it off so I think this might have also been in my uh, spring project use it up but this scent was really yummy yeah it was an amazing like cake batter scent really really good these two went really well together Christmas cookies and confetti cake pop they went really well together just like a nice gourmand vanilla scent really loved it and then I guess you could say I used this one with those as well. Coconut cream pie in the mini, um, body mist, fragrance mist. And it has a slight bit left at the bottom, but I couldn't get it out because my lid or my sprayer has been broken pretty much the entire time I've been trying to use this up. Um, but progress lines, I had it up to here and then I went down to here and then I used it up in the last month. But yeah, it just won't spray anymore. Instead, it just like spurts out and then runs down the side. So I decided to just note that this one's finished. It's really right about here, but I can't get the rest out, so. And then I did finish off a full-size body scrub. So this is the Dove um, Mango Body, or sorry, Crushed Almond and Mango Butter Body Polish. Loved this stuff. I really do like the Dove Body Scrub formula because it's a lot gentler so I can use it pretty much every day and that's what I did with this to finish it up so there it is finished it was so good and yummy and mangoey and perfect for the summertime super happy to have finished this one so I can move on to another one because I did buy three during summer SAS and I just bought two of the new tree hut fall scrubs so I definitely needed to get through this one and the next scrub I have to update you guys on is the Onyx bathhouse hot mess express scrub and this one is super super coarse and thick and like really really great at exfoliating so i have gotten a lot of progress on this if i scraped away the side actually i'd be about right here um this was unused when i put it in last month so i have used it maybe about four or five times it smells so good it smells like honey i think it's a honey pomegranate scent pomegranate musk and honey it's great it's amazing such a good scent so i've been loving this and this color you like you can't it's so beautiful and it lathers really really well so still working on this one 
and I'd say we're about right here just where the words start on the back of the packaging so yeah that's how we're going on this one and the last thing that I finished off is this little mini number seven I'm sorry number six tangerine squeeze perfume from the mix bar I do have progress lines on this one it started out in unused right here went down in a month and then finished it so really happy that I finished this one off it was nice but I don't think I would purchase a full size okay let's get into some progress so first I have my two body washes so I have beach nights in the shower gel been absolutely loving this one I definitely was focused on Christmas cookies so I don't have as much progress on this one um as I did last month so last month I did from here all the way down to here and this month I did from here to here so not a lot of progress hoping to finish this one off in the month of August so I can call this empty and I do already have a backup that I'm saving for next year such a great scent I've just been obsessed with it and then on sunshine mimosa and the moisturizing body wash I did still get some good progress on this one so from here to here so I've definitely been using it and enjoying it especially if I'm taking like a morning shower I really do love this in the mornings I feel like the other ones kind of strip too much in the morning and this one I feel like is really good and moisturizing so I've been using this one I probably won't finish it up but that's okay I might even just like keep this in for the fall um if I'm feeling like summer scents but honestly you guys it's still 100 degrees here in Texas so I'm not ready for fall I feel like in August I might have like one day or like a couple days where I'm craving it and then I'll put in like some fall shower gel or something but I don't think I would like actually use it a lot so I'm not going to start the fall project till September because I just can't with this weather but yeah there's the progress on that one I'm going to continue to use it and I do have the end goal to finish this up that's why I say I might keep it in for the fall okay body lotions I actually made pretty good progress on even though I was really focusing on confetti cake pop and margarita cupcake um, so I do have Beach Nights, which I have been using. I have a little bit of progress from here to here. So unused to right about like a fourth. I've used a fourth of it. So I'm going to keep focusing on this one. Hopefully I can finish it off in a month. That's kind of a tall ask for me to finish off the rest of this in a month. But we'll see how far I can get on it. Really trying to focus on it. And then we have White Pumpkin and Chai in the body lotion. This is from 2020. Or yeah, no. Yes, 2020 and I'm using it as a hand lotion on my sink right now. I've gotten some good progress on it, so I've gotten from here to here, and you can see the progress lines right here. So making good headway on it. I think I'm gonna try near the end of August when I know I'm gonna be craving scents like this. I'm gonna try and use it up on my body just to get it used a little quicker, and hopefully I can get rid of this before the fall project. That would be great, but if not, it'll be the first thing that I finish in the vault project for sure. And then this one I've been really good at using. This is the Peppermint Essential Oil uh, hand lotion, or really it's a body lotion, but I've been using it as a hand lotion on my desk for work. And I've gone from here to here. I'm getting steady use of about this much per month using it on my table for work. I put this on every single time I have a meeting, so that's about two to four times a day. So I've been really good about using this. And every time I feel like my hands are dry, I'm putting this on. So it's actually been really nice and calming. This peppermint scent is really like growing on me. So I might have to get another one like this or maybe another aromatherapy type of lotion with this hand pump um, to use as a hand lotion once I finish this one, but I still have this much left. So this will probably take me the rest of the year to finish. I'm assuming if I'm gonna keep using it at this rate. Okay, next I have the sprays, the body sprays. So first I have Champagne Toast, which I have gotten some good progress on. Not as much as last update, but I do have this to this. So I've been using it a little bit, really just as like a refresher around the house. I'm hoping to have this finished up uh, by the end of the year. So I'm just gonna keep working towards this and using it as like a room spray downstairs in the living room. Just keep using it. And um, my goal actually was just to get it to the middle of the bottle but i've gotten past that so i'm really proud of myself for just continuing to use this and every now and then i do crave some sort of like fruity scent like this so i've been using it a lot the goal is to have it used up by the end of the year and then i have bonfire bash right here which i do have a little bit of progress on not enough to be good in my opinion um so from here to here so i used it up a little bit i think i'm gonna swap this one and beach nights this one right now is on my desk 
for work and this one is upstairs so I use this every morning so I think I'm gonna swap it because I've gotten a lot more progress on beach nights so beach nights I've gotten from here to here so a little sizable chunk pretty much twice as much as bonfire bash so I think I'm gonna swap these two so I can get more use out of bonfire bash I feel like this would be an easy one to keep in for fall I still am undecided if I'm going to keep it in but I'd like to get it to the halfway point which is right here on like the diamond part of the bonfire bash packaging so I'd like to get it there. Um, I feel like that's kind of a lot to use up in a month, but I could really do it. I could do it if I focused on it. So I think I'm gonna move Beach Nights downstairs and not focus on it as much because this is the only one I have and I do wanna save it for next year too, so. Okay, last category to update you guys on is perfumes. So the first one I have is the Mary Kay Winter Wishes. You guys know I've been using this up for a long time since I think the beginning of the year. So we are now down to here, which is really good. I'm definitely gonna have this finished up by the end of the year. Um, it's just like a very fruity scent and I'm kind of getting sick of it. So I might retire this for the fall project just because like I said, I'm getting sick of it and finding myself not reaching for it. So I feel like after next month, I'll retire this and bring it back in the winter project probably so not that much left though I really only have this much left so um this one I can't update you guys on but it's the Ariana Grande uh sweet like candy perfume I love this it's so yummy um these two are actually kind of similar so I really have been loving this one more um so I've been using it a little bit um I can't really tell when it's going to be done until it's done so I'm just going to keep working on it I'm enjoying it so and then the last thing I have to update you guys on is the number 21 Cloud Musk from the Mix Bar. I really have been loving it. I've gone from here to here, so I'm about halfway, and I'll probably finish this up in August. But yeah, I've been really loving this one. I can probably say for certain I'm going to purchase this one in a full size. So yeah, I can see myself purchasing this one and the vanilla bourbon one maybe around like Black Friday if they have like a deal or something. I could definitely see myself purchasing those two in a full size soon. Okay, and I'm gonna add in two things to the project which I'm not expecting to use up, but I just wanna get progress on. The first is Sweet Whiskey in the Celestial Body Scrub. Super excited to try this one. I only had one item in Sweet Whiskey last year and I think it was a mini uh, body cream. Sorry if you can hear the train. Um, but since I did finish off the Dove Scrub, I need another scrub that I can use on like the daily, a daily basis. So I figured this one is pretty light on consistency, so it's not going to be super um, harsh and coarse. So I feel like this is a good everyday one. The notes on this are golden amber, vanilla infused liqueur, sweet red berries. Made with glow enhancing ingredients, leaves skin feeling smooth and soft, looking healthy and radiant with shea and vitamin E. So yeah, I think this one will be really good to use up uh, or to use next month in August and then it'll probably end up going into fall since it is a fall scent. So yeah, and this packaging is so cute. I don't know how I didn't notice how beautiful this this purple is. It's so gorgeous. So I will be focusing on that. And then I am gonna put in the Trader Joe's Brazil Nut Body Butter. So excited. So I did purchase this a few weeks ago. I finally found it at my Trader Joe's after looking for like two years. Um, and I've been using it a little bit and I've loved it. So it was uh, full up to the top and I've already used it quite a bit. I use a lot whenever I actually use it and I only use it after I shower, I mean, after I shave. So I really need the moisture and it's been so good. It smells like Brazilian bum bum cream. It smells so good. So I feel like in August, this is gonna be a great scent to reach for when I really want that moisture to lock into my skin. So I just wanna get some progress on it because I don't, I don't gravitate towards body butters a lot but the only moisturizer that I have in right now is Beach Nights. So I feel like this is for the days when I want light moisture and this will be for the days where I want a lot of moisture. So yeah, not trying to finish this one up, just trying to get some progress on it. Okay, so that is everything for my summer project use it up update for the month of August. I hope you guys enjoyed this and go ahead and subscribe and turn your bell notifications on so you're notified when I upload the finale and then the intro to my fall project use it up. And if you aren't already, um, check out my vlogs because I do talk a lot about my project use it up my progress and then whenever I'm picking out new products I do talk about that as well so just a little tidbit of information if you want to see the behind the scenes on things so that's everything for today's video I hope you guys enjoyed let me know what you are using right now for body care down below I'm super interested to hear what you're gravitating towards if you're already into fall stuff let me know but yeah I will see you all in the next one bye